Good morning, everybody. I hope you're having a fine start to the day. It's a non snowy start to the day. Let's just accept that 54 degrees going to be patchy fog, cloudy conditions. Uh, we had all of that and uh, cloudy and cool tonight. 34 degrees winds north 5 to 10 miles an hour. So we see the shift. This system continues to make its, wor uh, its way down the west coast as it exits. It's going to kick out a little bit and we're going to see a little bit of that energy through tomorrow. 42 yesterday with uh, the, you know, almost a third of an inch of moisture. Now in the form of snow is a record one inch. Um, so we'll add that to our totals. We're still 15 something inches behind normal. 54 is the average high this time of year. We will get to that. 81 the record high, 23 the record low. 728 the sun sets tonight, by the way. Uh, morning temperatures uh, were on the cool side, around freezing. 34 to Coeur d'Alene. They warmed up nicely. We did have, and watch for it, the pink firing up north of Odessa. So we do have rain snow mix there, rain in uh, Ritzville. They had some, and then all the way into the Palouse. Big picture. Um, this low continues to work its way south. It will kick out. We will see enough energy that we could, again, trigger a shower or two, maybe a thunder shower. Nationally, um, the nation is split temperature wise here. Severe weather expected along this frontal boundary. Kentucky, Louisville, still flooding issues there. Um, you can see where the cold side cold, hot side hot. And look at the difference. Uh, really, we're going to see this cold weather continue to move into New England. In the mid-Atlantic states, it will get warmer. It's going to get hot and humid into the deep south. 54 Tuesday, that's today. 58 on Wednesday with, again, that kick out a chance of a thunder shower there. Thursday and Friday look to be pretty nice, but an increased chance of cloud cover and showers Friday night into Saturday. The front comes in 52 on the back side of that. Windy at times with showers. Um, breezy on Sunday, 50, and then Monday should be 54, cloudy, and everyone's back into school. Spring break is over. Back to business. All right, thank you so much for checking out KXOY.com. Got a lot of great information, and don't forget, Hometown Chevrolet is trying to build a new baseball park, but we need your entries. Just go to the front page and uh, right on there, you're going to be able to click on that 200 words or less. We'd love to hear about your field and what it needs, okay? Uh, you only have till the middle of the month. I'm Mark Peterson. Thanks again.